Oh, here we are with Pokemon Omega Ruby now. Randomize. And we're going to be doing another Nuzlocke. Catch up on our Pokemon Y Nuzlocke, which I uploaded the rest of it today. So you'll have to go see what it's all about and how we win. Or lose. But the other way, we're starting a new Nuzlocke today. Today is going to be Omega Ruby. I understand it's a remake, but it's such a different remake because of the Mega Evolutions and how the story goes that I will be doing it to see if I can beat this one in the Nuzlocke as well, just like I have done with many other games. And if we lose at this one, we'll move on to... I think it's Ultra Sun is next. I think I only chose one of the Alola games. I know I said I chose both because they were different, but I think I just actually chose one. I'm not sure. We'll be a boy, of course. This time, however, our name is going to be... To coincide with our channel. We are... Crux. Yes, I am moving to Little Root. Actually, I just remembered something I was going to do, and we'll do it right here on the stream. Or stream. This is in a stream. Oh, we don't want hybrid. There we go. This is how we're going to do this Nuzlocke. Because I'm going to use... It has a lot less blank space and you can already see the team when it pops up although I might still put a little thing in the corner there let's go see Professor Birch this way it takes up less space of the screen and I don't have to have all that black. You guys can tell me if you enjoy it this way or not. If you don't, we can go back to the previous way and I can work on just doing the overlay that I did last time where I had the current badges on the left and I had the current team on the right. But if not, I hope this is a better way to enjoy it. I know everything's a little more zoomed in being it's a bigger screen technically, but it's more of the gameplay than having the small 3DS-like screen on this totally legit 3DS as to keep up with the meme that it's totally legit when it's not. Ah uh, yes, the fastest text makes it so I don't have to talk very much to them. 
Oh, yes, we get to see what our Pokemon are. Let's see what our starters are. Oh, that's a beautiful starter over there. We have Seal, Solosis, or Darkrai. I'd be a fool if I didn't choose Darkrai. So, given that I don't get much combat interaction, I'm going to choose my starter. If I see more combat interaction throughout the next playthroughs and stuff, I will hold off and let you guys choose the starter. But I'm impatient, so I'm choosing Darkrai. Let's see what we have to fight. A whole ass Whalmer. What does a level 5 Darkrai have? Ominous Wind, huh? Ooh, I was cool. Splash! Fantastic! <laughs> Alright, let's go to your lab, buddy. Yes! Definitely was Mudkip. Yes, we are going to nickname Mudkip. Otherwise known as Darkrai. This is Emo. That is the perfect name for Darkrai. His name is Emo. Sure, I'll head out to 103. Okay. Okay, no Pokeballs yet. Wait, what does this guy have? Anything? What can I encounter on Route 101? Oh, just a whole ass Xerneas! Goodbye! That'd be amazing to catch that. Just have a whole ass Xerneas and a Darkrai. Let's. What else is here in this route? An Articuno! What is this? I mean, I know I randomized it. Ah, yes, Old Dale Town. Yay, potions! Potions! Uh, there's joy, yep. Mm -hmm. Is this Route 103? Good. Let's go talk to May! Gentmax in her Solosis. Go, Emo. I know I hit fastest text when I randomize, but like the emotion the this seems faster for some reason than X and Y did. But I'm okay with that. Okay. I mean, the music doesn't sound sped up, so... This must be faster? I don't know, I haven't played Omega Ruby in a while. 
Or Alpha Sapphire. Oh boy, and our Nuzlocke begins with Potai Pokeballs. I don't know, is this like every other Pokemon game where I have to go in here and tell my mother? Okay. Alright, do I have to go talk to May's mom? I don't remember. Pokemon games where I actually have a father. Oh boy, what do we get to catch? Oh Jesus! You got to give me the catching tutorial now, don't you? Oh look, Pokenav Plus. That's cool. I don't care. Let me catch a Pokemon. What do I get? 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 Do I, get? <laughs> I saw what Zerdy is! I saw a friggin' Articuno, and I get stuck with a Poliwag. <laughs> that sounds about right. I have a name for you after seeing those Pokemon and getting you. Yes, I have a nickname for you. This, ladies and gentlemen, this is disappointment. Yeah, okay, it's just disappoint. I might have spelled disappoint wrong, so it's disappoint. Oh, there's the Articuno! I should've went in that glass! I can go get my 103 encounter now. What do I get? Oh, what do I get? Oh, what do I... I'll take a Kimbuskin. Uh... Let's... Try a Pokeball? If not, then we'll try an ominous wind. Oh, 
Okay, okay. That's all we're doing. Ah, bugger nuts. Oh, yeah! Pocket sand! Gotta come busking. Yes, we're going to name it because it knows sand attack. This is pocket sand. We go heal pocket sand. Bing, 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 bing. What do we get on Route 102? A Merkwow! Merkwow! We're gonna try a Pokeball first! Well then, Peck! We're gonna change to... Combustion, or Pocket Sand. Try an ember. They should live one more ember. If I don't flinch first. Jesus! Uh, let's not have pocket sand out now. And remember that pocket sand is part fighting type, so flying type is no no bueno. Come on, get the ball. Good boy. This is Dab. Alright, let's run back and heal Dab real quick.
Oh boy, battle time. What will Fan Scott have today? A low putty. I thought I clicked not to keep them in the mega forms. Whatever. Oh, ghost type move does not affect low putty. Okay. That's a level 4, so we'll use pocket sand. Okay. Splash! Uh oh. I beat it before it kills me. Oh, thank you. Woot, level four. Woot, level five. Woot, level six. Jesus, level seven. What's in the grass? It's a war turtle. It's a war turtle. It's a war turtle. Goodbye, war turtle. I don't want to fight you. Okay, let's fight the bump trainer and see what he's got. <coughs> Developer Christian has an Alakazam of all things. A mega. Why is everything a mega? I'm gonna just wanted to do pretty good though. <laughs> Cause it's a ghost type move. Just murdered. Absolutely murdered an Alakazam. Oh Cristiano, I'm sorry. Goodbye, Cristiano. I just wanted the berries, man. Hello fan Mar Why is everything Marcellus? It's the return of Marcellus. Let's hope Ominous Wind just murders this samurai. Oh no, a water gun. Ominous Wind again. Goodbye, samurai. Chimchar. No, I think an Ominous Wind should do okay. Considering he's level 2. Bye bye now. Just Marcellus. Woohoo, Petra Berries. If you think I'm gonna plant berries, you're sorely mistaken. My luck from the last run that I did of a Nuzlocke is probably gonna be the same here. So I will never get a flying type Pokemon, even though I have one currently. Hello, Mark Cactus. Bye, bye, Mark Cactus. What is over this way? Oh, just a shortcut back there. Okay. Crap. Dancer Pansy sends out a scissor. Emo. 
I have no more Pippa for that. So we're gonna switch to Pocket Sand. We should take out this Bug Steel type pretty easily. Or if he's just a Steel type. I don't remember if he's both or not. Oh my god, guys, by the way, I have a Fire type. If anyone's seen my previous run, or previous Nuzlocke, you know how I feel about having a Fire type. It's probably a death sentence. This death sentence is leveling up pretty fast, though. Not gonna lie. A blue shard? Whoa. I think that's just money. Oh, hi, May. What am I looking at? Buddha flies? Cool. Look at them flutter. Look at them fly. Look at them flap. They're such a butterfly. I don't know. Uh huh. Alright, we made it to Petalburg. place to end this episode hope you're all enjoying our new nuzlocke and the fact that i'm doing okay so far catch y'all next time